Hello, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to delete a database in Notion. Here's a step-by-step -step guide on how to delete a database in Notion. First, launch Notion in your browser and sign in if necessary. In the left-hand sidebar, locate the page containing the database you want to delete and click on it to open the page. So I'm heading over to read a list. Scroll to the page until you find the specific database that you want to delete. Now, this database could be a table, a board, or a list. Go ahead and find the database. And I have this over here. Hover over your mouse over the database block. Okay. And once you do that, you're going to see a six dotted icon also called the block handle, appear on the left side of the database. Click on the six dotted icon, which is the block handle, to open the block options. In the block options menu, you're going to see a couple of options, which include comment, suggest, ask AI, delete, duplicate, copy link to block, turn into database, and you have move to go ahead and click on delete so press the delete key on the keyboard or click on delete so once you click on delete that's just going to be pretty much it the database will be deleted from the page Now you see the database will be deleted from the page. Now remember, deleting a database only removes it from the current page, but it doesn't delete the underlying data if the database is linked. So the original database will be stored in the Notion unless deleted permanently from its original page. If you want to permanently delete the database, go to settings, all right? So go ahead and click on your profile in here then click on settings and once you click on settings click on account from the options in here and head over to delete okay so you're going to see delete my account and once you click on delete my account it deletes all the data from all your workspaces it deletes permanently all your data from all your workspaces so here you have your workspace permanently delete account and workspace and all your data will be permanently deleted so if the database is is in a linked view or is a linked view deleting it from a page will only remove that view not original data so make sure the database isn't linked elsewhere before deletion if you want to keep a copy that's pretty much the process now you can go over this tutorial from top to bottom to get acquainted with the steps and of course once you're done you will be good to go I hope this tutorial marvelously helped you search.